I'm Tracy Chevalier. I'm a novelist, probably best known for my novel, Girl with a Pearl Earring. I've been involved with fine cell work for six years, and I'm now a patron. Fine Cell Work is a charity that goes into UK prisons and teaches prisoners how to sew, to embroider, to quilt. They make products that they then sell to the public. Fine Cell Work is soon celebrating its 25th anniversary. And we've put together, in collaboration with Writers 26, this wonderful book, which unpacks some of the stories behind its most notable work. 26 is a writer's organization. Some of us are novelists, authors, playwrights, poets, business writers, content managers, editors. And what we do is we effectively crowd write. So we bring together a number of writers to work on a specific theme, perhaps for a specific charity or a cause. It's 25 years of actual artworks, but it's also 25 years of stories. So it's prisoners, volunteers, artists, designers, everyone who's been involved in making these extraordinary objects come into being. Rehabilitation in prison is key, and I'm amazed that more resources aren't put into it. Most prisoners who, who enter prison are going to leave it and, and re-enter society, and they need to be helped to be able to do that. I expect it to be punished, you know. It's taught me that people's lives can change very dramatically in a very short time. The justice system is just very wrong. And you're just throwing people into a cell, you release them, and you expect them to change. I think it's common sense, <laughs> that's not going to happen. That for many, it's probably been the first time they've actually achieved something. And that's our first step into showing there is life beyond crime. I'm very hopeful that people reading this book will be inspired to see what can be made in prison and what can be done with prison time. When you think about it, prisoners are locked away and there's so much time, so much time on their hands and what better than to do something productive and beautiful with their time and also to make money and to give them a sense of self-worth, a sense of achievement, a sense of purpose for life beyond prison. All of us are working on this for free. What we need is a bit of money to go towards the production costs of making this book happen. So once the production costs are covered, any money raised is going to the charitable work of Fine Cell Work. <laughs>